Happy New Year, everyone! Happy New Year! I'm so happy! <laughs> I've not filmed any video in such a long time, but anyways, I just knew I had to put up a video today to wish you all a very Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you guys. Um, thank you guys so much for all the support. That's really why I wanted to film this video, actually. I just wanted to say a very big thank you to you guys for all the support I got 2023. Obviously, I've always felt supported. I've always been supported. Yeah, I just wanted to come out here and tell you guys thank you. 2023 was such an interesting year for me um like i feel like 2023 work wise i did not see so much growth if you get what i mean obviously there's always growth like there was growth right but i did not see like so much growth but personal life wise 2023 was so amazing for me and my family like i was just talking to her my sister in law here by the way obviously hi She's here. <laughs> I don't even know if I've told you guys, but they are here for the holiday. My two sister-in-laws are here. My two and only sister-in-laws. And they're here with the kids and everybody's having so much fun. But anyways, that being said, my two sister-in-laws. You're my two sister-in-laws. No, they're not the same. But it's not the same now. Like, you people are my husband's sisters. They're my sister-in-laws, right? But it's another type of sister-in-law. <laughs> exactly. So basically, um, we've been having so much fun. And I was just talking to Obi about this. This morning, literally, I was like, personally, like in my marriage, my relationship, with both my children and my husband, and really everybody around me, like, I, it wasn't what, is it witnessed or whatever? Is it, we can't be witnessed. I am, um, what's the word, experienced, <laughs> experienced so much growth, like it's unbelievable. So much growth i feel like my husband and i were nine years plus married now right going on 10 years and i feel like we're finally at that point where i can say that we've aligned i don't know how to explain it like <laughs> we're now like this you know it happens gradually over the years and everything we went through even moving into our first home that we built ourselves together and all the things that happened before and just sharing the joy of this new home with our kids with the family and then he witnessed like growth like in his own work and then me like everything just kind of aligned for us this year even though technically like when it comes to my work as an influencer i feel like i did very well this year but i feel like i could have done better but i don't even mind because where it actually counts like i did amazing and i'm just so happy i'm ending the year in such a high i'm filming this video on the 31st so you're watching it on the first and i'm ending the year in such a high and i was able to also achieve a lot of my personal goals this year right not like work wise again and not goals that I share with my husband, just like personal goals, things I wanted to do. Like the only thing I didn't finish, like the one thing I didn't finish um, that I, I wanted to get done this year is like there's something I want to like open, like I want to take, I don't know how to explain it without, without spilling too much, but it's already something I do share that I just want to take to the next level and be able to like do it in a higher capacity. It's not a business, it's just like, giving and helping and things like that i wasn't able to completely achieve that but that's priority for me next year but i'm still okay with all that i was able to do this year and i'm just so grateful and so happy <laughs> but about that 2024 hmm 2024 is going to be amazing me i already know i already know that 2024 is going to be that year okay another thing is that i did not travel a lot this year when i was compiling my end of year video not like all this year, Thank you. No, not thank you for the. Um, and with that, the, the uh, what's that audio? And with that, 2023 has come to an end. Good night. You know that audio. When I wanted to make that video, I realized that it almost felt like I didn't have fun this year. <laughs> it almost felt that we almost, even though I know I had fun, but I feel like I've had better years when it comes to fun. But again, this year we're so focused on on our house and other projects and my husband is one of those Igbo men my husband is a complete Igbo Newy man okay money no they say for accounts money cannot be seen in the account like what is the money doing inside the account so it's almost like once we finish one big project there's another big project waiting for us and then there's another big project so it's like there's there was always something for us to do this year with money there was always something for us to try to achieve there was always something to do so i really feel like i didn't travel like almost like i didn't have fun even though i had fun but i feel like i've had like better years when it comes to traveling the world and just enjoying myself generally um but yeah next year we go again because i've told him see excuse me 
My official name now is Oriakode. See, from today, can all of you start calling me Oriakode? That is the name I want to go by. Don't say Nello. That's that was my 2023 name. From now on, is Oriako. In fact, if possible, I can change my name to Oriako because that's what I want to be known for in life. I want to be known as that woman that just enjoys herself, chops her husband's money, keeps her own in the account, and just enjoys life. Okay, that's what I want to be known for. So um, I've told my husband, see, this Oriako cannot be for mouths. <laughs> it cannot be for months. You have to give me the Ako today because <laughs> we cannot be asking the Oriako and we are hungry and we are not traveling. I want to enjoy ourselves. But um, I know that next year is going to be great. More like this year. Are you watching this video? It's going to be great. We already have plans. We still have so much to do. But we are trying to make our time for like fun. YouTube wise, my career wise, to be honest, I have not really like thought about it, thought about it. Like I don't know the goals I'm setting for myself next year. I'm not the kind of person that likes setting goals. I've told you guys on this channel before. I don't know what goals I want to set for myself. I don't know what I want to achieve. I just know I'm okay with constant growth. It might be slow, it can be fast sometimes, like if any video goes viral or anything, but I'm just okay always with constant growth. Yeah, I'm just so happy and so grateful that all my family members so it's the end of this year. I'm sorry you guys, I did not do vlogmas. I didn't even vlog. I went to the village, but I didn't stay long in the village. Some of you might have noticed. I only spent four days in the village. My intention was to actually go back because I wanted to do something in the family, but I don't know if that will work out or not. But I didn't stay long in the village because the, there were kids in my house, things were going on, and I just needed to be present for those things. But I didn't vlog, I didn't do vlogmas. I went to Angie's house. Angie's house was so much fun. It was really, really fun. NJ like it was the best time, like clubbing in Oka was lit, okay, like it was lit lit but I just didn't want to vlog, I told you guys, I shared you guys previously that I was I was going to like take a break from YouTube so I just tried to use December as an opportunity and enjoy myself full time with no pressure of vlogging and that's exactly what I did and next year we are, rev we are reviving our second channel you guys, I'm saying it now so that I will not just let it pass it in. Like I will not just um, be lazy and not revive it. I already have plans for the channel. The name is changing again. I, I know, I know. I've changed the name like 10 times at this point, but it's part of my, should I say part of the plans I have for my channel next year or my career? I just said now and I don't have any goals, but maybe this is one of the goals I have. Reviving the channel, the Cook with Nello, Nello KKTV slash the new name now. Like I'm changing it again. I'll let you guys know when it's ready. And you guys, trust me, you're going to love it this time. And this time there's no quitting, okay? There is no quitting. I'm just so happy. Like I I was just having this conversation with my sister in law. I was like, I feel like I've had happier years. Like the year 2021 was a fantastic happy year for me. 2022, fantastic. 2023, fantastic. They, they were like, yes, I was just telling her, like the three years, like my last three years are amazing right but i feel like the happiness i feel now is not about like i had the best year i had the most fun or whatever but it's almost like happiness from within like i feel like i'm where i'm supposed to be my life is aligning just the way i wanted to align like things are happening for me exactly the way i dreamt it and not just dreamt it exactly the way that i knew it would turn out I'm one of those people that I just know, okay? I just know. When I tell people that, you see this Nigeria I'm inside, I'm going to make it so much in this country that I can wake up in the morning and decide to be here. In fact, people will be begging me, calling me from countries to come and maybe speak speak at this event, do this at that, I don't know, but I am going to build the life I want here. And I feel like my life is finally aligning because I'm finally able to, it's almost like I've built my life uh, I've gotten to a point now that I'm not able to spread my wings. Do you guys get? I don't know if I'm explaining myself well. I feel like I'm practically wrapping at this point. But I'm so grateful. Like, I'm just, my happiness is, is actually contagious at this point. Because it's like, well, if you know me now, it's like, I don't know, it's hard for my happiness not to enter your own because I'm just in a very happy place and I'm grateful, I'm thankful, thank God for protection, thank God for like, um, you know, health, shelter, everything. I don't want this video to be too long, I feel like I've rambled enough. I really just wanted to come out here and tell you guys, thank you for an amazing 2023 and may God bless you all, like God bless you all, may all your wishes, your deepest heart desire, you know that prayer you have been praying and begging God to grant you, God is going to grant you this year. Like, I'm a strong believer in that. And 
when another thing you guys should know and another thing you should keep in mind is even if you're praying for something and it's not happening god's time is the best like i think that is my motto like let go and let god I live by that if i want something now and i really want that thing and it doesn't happen or even a lot of times when bad things are happening or like you see yourself in bad situations i just tell myself yeah 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 it was supposed to be like i was supposed to be in this situation because god has a better plan for me okay like this bad thing now like i was like oh mm, god i tried to pray me for something <laughs> you want me to be angry first then you now shock me with happiness just always have that in mind i feel like i give people this advice all the time everything happens for a reason and maybe because i believe it truly and genuinely it always works out well for me in the end when anything bad happens i don't dwell you guys will rarely see me do well on anything bad like i said i don't dwell on how horrible nigeria is how tough life is it's tough everywhere life is tough everywhere life is hard everywhere like nobody has it easy at this point everybody's working extra hard for every single thing that they have now so it's like instead of complaining just keep trying keep working hard and when is your time it's your time. Probably just making you noise know, that wake up. <laughs> I'm sure I, in your mind you're like, you are not going. You okay? I don't blame you because you know me. Because you know me. Anyways, I think I'm just going to end the video here. Like I said, I just want to come and wish you guys all. I mean, wish you all a very happy new year. This year is going to be the best one yet for all of us. I hope you guys have a fantastic day today and a fantastic year. And I'll catch you guys later this month i don't know when i'll be coming back but i have you to be mind okay but i'll come back better all right i'll catch you guys soon bye guys